Hello and welcome everybody. I'm Prefix Wiz. I'm coming at you with another Unity tutorial. In this series, Unity Tips and Tricks, we're going over a topic of asset folder organization. Counting double digit values. <laughs> Okay, let's dive into the asset folder organization. Some of you may feel like this is common sense, and a lot of it is. However, we get caught up in the process of actually developing and not organizing. But a good way to stay organized early is to go ahead and set up your project the same way every single time, no matter what, to keep that organization strong in the early phases of your development. It's very easy to get folder management out of control. It's very easy to download assets and bring assets in and create folders to hold those assets for just a little while. And before you know it, you have 17 folders or a lot more with folders inside of those folders, and then you can't find anything. So I'm here to show you a different way of doing things, a way that I found works for me. All right, so for test purposes, uh, I set up a folder in a way that it would be cluttered uh, like a typical project that's not very well organized, or maybe it is very well organized to you, but it could be done a little differently. Um, so I went ahead and organized this folder. It's, it's very chaotic. It's, you know, it's just, it's just out there. So I'm going to give you a, the ways the folders look when I started doing this. i give you a little insight on what we were dealing with here. So it's very easy to, again, get your folders to spiral out of control. So if we click on assets here, we're going to drop down all the folders that I have in the scene. And you will see that they have uh, folders within folders within folders. And, and it would be very hard to find things in this manner. So here you have all these folders and, again, folders within folders. And it's kind of hard to keep track of what's going on and what's going where. Um, Unity did uh, throw in this nice feature. It's a um, where you can find specific things in your asset folders. So, if, for instance, all your scripts will pop up here: prefab, prefabs, models, and materials. But that doesn't help you if you have thousands of scripts, thousands of prefabs, thousands of models, thousands of materials. It does help if you have one or two, or if you're looking for something specific. Um, for instance, if you already know the name of the script or you already know the name of the model, but sometimes even we name the models um, close to one another, character one, character two, character one underscore whatever. Um, so all the characters are going to pop up. So it's still a little daunting. And what we can do to minimize the clutter is something very simple. So I'm going to show you. First, you see the folder as a cluttered mess, if you will. Okay, so take a look here. And what we have here is my core folders that I use in every single project, no matter what. Animations, prefabs, scenes, scripts, and textures. Now, the reason why I put the underscore first is because it doesn't matter what you have in your project. The underscore will always show up at the top of your asset folder list. And notice that all of the other folders show up below it. There is one other folder that I like to have in all my projects, and that folder is called Z underscore delete in all caps. Now, first, the Z puts that folder at the bottom of the asset folder list. So that way it's not in my way. But at the same time, it's in all caps because I also know that that's something that I have to deal with at a later time. When I bring assets in, I bring them into the delete folder. And what happens is, is anything that goes into the delete folder, I take what I need out of it and I make sure that I have all the components that are with it and I put them into my core folders. Everything else stays in the delete folder. That way at the end of my project, all I have to do is shift delete and it is gone, I don't have to worry about it any longer. So that's how I organize my asset folders. It helps me stay organized very early on in the game. So whenever I start a project, I always have those core folders in every single project. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I really hope it helps. And I'm really excited to hear about the way you guys feel about how I organize my asset folder. So go ahead and post that comment. Let me know what you think. 
you like this tutorial, go ahead and click that like button and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.